Hey guys, Tony Sorry, Sass, 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 and welcome to another episode of Cigar Review. Today, normal cigar. A normal cigar. <coughs> so, we have the Corona, uh, if I get this right, Corona Nicaraguan 25th anniversary, Bordan Sangron, Maduro Toro. There we go. Okay, so this cigar is sent over by. Smoke one if you have one, Eric. And you know, even though we make fun of him for not smoking like sub twenty dollars cigar, he does buy them. So I don't know. Now, if I did, remember, I I'm pretty sure he sent me this one because I like, guess in the pile of all these cigars. So I didn't buy it. So it has to be fan from him. This thing six by fifty four, and uh, the wrapper is Brazilian. Ara Piraca. Binders uh, for Rodan Sangro. Filler is Nicaraguan. So. Hmm. How we gonna do this? You know what? We'll go to the B roll. Let me show you the cigar up close. So here is the cigar. And I'm trying to get the lights right because I'm not sure how bright this really looks like. But yeah. Here's a cigar. Look at the band. It's like red and white and uh, kind of like a floral print. Uh, the leaf is very textured. Uh, it's got that almost like sandpaper texture to it. And the foot has a, a Florida Sangron foot band. Uh, it says Florida Sangron on the gold wording and there's a signature on there. Uh, this is for Florida Sangron. Uh, yeah, it's, it's overall Pretty nice cigar. It's, it looks good. It looks nicely done. It doesn't look like a $11 cigar. It looks a little bit more expensive than that. Here's the FUD. Um, you know, it, it, it looks nicely put together. So I am going to smoke this now. Okay, so we're back. And that means it's time to cut and light. Cut and light. You know, I, I'm... I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna get this to be seamless in the future, but I haven't got there yet. So very, very cedary. Almost sweet. A little bit woodsy. Like a like a fermented sweet smell to it. Hold draw. Blah. Cold draw is slightly nice. A little amount of pepper with some little amount of fermentiness with a little amount of mushroom and leather we'll take off this foot band foot band let's hope that doesn't rip anything off okay here's a foot band like i said one side says for the sun grown yeah for the sun grown and the other side has a signature. Very nice. I mean, this red, white, and gold combination is not too bad. Not too bad at all. MSRP $11. We'll see what you get for $11. Mm. Mm. Mm.
Whoa. What? Again, fermentiness. A little bit sour bitterness. Woodsy. Peppery. Corojo esque mineral and earthiness. I don't know if there's a Corojo in this. It says Fora Sangro. Is that Fora Sangro Corojo? I don't know. Yep. Roughly about medium strength. Cedar start to come up a little bit. A little bit like water taste or something like that, like mineral water. Draw is not bad. Smoke output is not bad. Okay. With that being said, we'll smoke one third. Come right back. All right. So I don't know what I'm going to say about this because I had a giant tunnel. And um, it wasn't burning well until, like, I didn't even find the tunnel until I tapped it down a little bit. So, yeah, I have this giant amber piece, you know, and it still tried to explode us from the inside out because all the hot air. But I got a little bit of clove. I got a little bit, maybe, like, some sort of baking spice and a little bit cedar. And that's pretty much it. There was nothing else. So yeah, uh, it was performed poorly and might be because of the tunnel, but it was performed very poorly. Hopefully this thing gets gets better as it burns through a little bit, but I'm trying my best onto it. I had a little bit of pepper and that's pretty much it. That's pretty much it for the one third. I guess this cigar will be like, you get what you pay for. It's here. All right. So yeah, I'm going to smoke one uh, another third somewhere here. And hopefully it gets better. We'll be right back. All right, second third. It tastes the same, but still so watered down. There's not much flavor. And then like the tunnel kind of fixed itself already. There's nothing else left. It's just not that good. It's watered down. It's uh, it's uh, it barely has any flavor, and it still had to deal with that median ish uh, uh, strength. That median strain is a little bit stronger for me because it took me so much to smoke through that one third. So it's not comfortable of a smoke. But anyways, ooh, ooh, I almost burned myself. Let's take a look at the band. There we go. I think the band is nice. It's like understated yet overstated. Uh, the line over here on the side almost look like really tiny words. It, it's, it, it looks pretty nice. I, I think this is nicely designed. It's just that uh, the cigar didn't fit. The cigar did not fit the, the anniversary 25th uh, or uh, for the sun-grown level of, uh, of flavor or, um, you know, it didn't deliver. It did not de deliver that, that cigar enjoyment. Uh, as of right now, this is a $6 cigar for me. But we'll see if the last year got improved, but $6 right now. Uh, that's pretty sad. For that some going supposed to be some some of the nicer cigars and this one did not have that enjoyment for me. It's very just watered down taste, like a mile, mile, mile taste. All right, last stir. Be right back. All right, that's the end of the cigar. You can see exploded and everything. It doesn't want to burn well. Six dollar cigar all day. Uh, not a good cigar. I don't like it. Uh, it's very watered down taste. Third, did not improve. In fact, I just keep tasting like steam or something like that. And if you're gonna say this thing is over humidified, this cigar is in the same place as the rest of my cigars. My cigars usually tend to run a little bit drier than usual. This thing has been sitting there for a long time and still wet. I don't know. I don't know. I don't like it. Uh, very disappointed. So $6 it is. I don't recommend it, but no.
if you need a like a budget cigar, maybe if they they sell, sell it's definitely not eleven dollars. Uh, in my in my opinion, it did not taste like eleven dollar or even have the construction of a eleven dollar cigar. So that being said, <clears throat> that will be this review. Yeah, that's a horrible cigar. That that will be it for this particular review. Make sure to like, subscribe, share, comment, do all that stuff. Join our membership if you want more content. Uh, we also have a uh, our podcast. And, and make sure to go listen to that as well. Thanks to uh, um, Eric for sending me this cigar. Now, I'll see you guys next time.